Hello everyone and welcome back to Missledyne Online Kingdom Hearts 2 on the PlayStation 4 The Final Mix on Critical Mode. In the last episode, we discovered a whole lot about Roxas here in the mansion. This does not look like the mansion that we saw in Twilight Town. Right on that screen definitely looks like a silhouette of the one and only Sora. This was the computer that we saw Diz at and this is where we, Roxas, were put into the uh the digital Twilight Town, so it appears like we are in the real Twilight Town. Let's continue forward, and let's learn just a little bit more about Roxas. All right, information to defeat the mysterious enemies. Let's go ahead and do that. We will throw in this. So we have four just with us. Of course, we are going to have to kill all of these waves of enemies, but we've done this numerous times. We are only level six right now. It is possible to get a, a lot of levels uh, before you even get to this point. Remember, stay on top of these assassins. Do not let them attack you once they're underground. They do that attack that this one's currently doing. Make sure you try to hit that. That will knock them out, and then you can finish them off. Almost. Level 7, baby. Simply amazing, Roxas. Axel, you really do remember me this time. I'm so flattered! But you're too late! Here we go, everybody. Oh, yeah. Two Keyblades. That's weird, huh? Guys, there is such a story reason as to why Roxas has two Keyblades, and I want you to keep that in mind for the future. Now, this is going to do damage on us, but we will stay on top of him. We are so much faster now, and we hit so much harder. Remember, we do have the Champion's Belt equipped, so we actually take less damage against fire, and we will just stay on top of him as much as possible, and then we will use our Overtaker Reaction Command and then Clear Light, baby. Hit him, and then we will stay on top of him yet again, and we will just hit Axel as much as possible. Again, remember, this is critical mode, so if he hits us, he's going to do a tremendous amount of damage, but as you can tell, uh, now we need to be careful of him when he goes into there, and then we need to hit him real quick. Oh, God. Uh, I'm going to use a potion real quick on Roxas. Do I have time? Yes, I do. Okay, good. This is very hard. I actually can't see him at all. Damn, fire. There we go. He's going to use that again. Now he's going to come into here. We need to be careful. Now, I could have used a reaction command if I was a little bit faster. But there we go. Burst Frontier. And we defeat Axel. And hit level 7. Maximum HP increased. You get on their bad side and they'll destroy you. No one would miss me. That's not true. I would. Axel. Let's meet again in the next life. Yeah, I'll be waiting. Silly. Just because you have a next life. Maybe Axel does too. Mansion Basement Hall. Guys, by the way, I love, love Axel. He's so good. Right here. It looks like it leads somewhere, but the power of darkness prevents entry. He can't actually use it. Very interesting. So we could go through this door, which leads to computer room that we were in before and we could save, or we can proceed through this door. Donald. Goofy? Goofy? 
What else are in these pods? It seems only the power is on. Donald and Goofy are here. Goofy is sleeping inside. Donald is sleeping inside. No Jiminy though, huh? He's probably one of those. He's just too small to see. Unfortunately, they actually didn't put him in. Right there, we can grab a high potion out of this chest, which is pretty wonderful. Maybe he's in this one? Are you in this one? This hasn't been used in a while. I guess not. Weird. No Gemini. All right. Proceed forward. At last. The key blades chosen one. Who are you talking to? Me? Or Sora? To half of Sora, of course. You reside in darkness. What I need is someone who can move about the realm of light and destroy Organization 13. Why? Who are you? I am a servant of the world. <laughs> and if I'm a servant, then you should consider yourself a tool at best. Was that... Was that supposed to be a joke? Cuz I'm not laughing! Ugh. My apologies. This is only a data-based projection. I hate you so much. You should share some of that hatred with Sora. He's far too nice for his own good. No! My heart belongs to me! Sora. like my summer vacation is over. The seventh episode, guys, and we just got to the title screen. I don't want to talk about it. When we get the trophy, summer's end. Hey! Oh my god, it's Mickey. And that magical tram from before. Sora! Who's there? Sora, wake up! Yeah, boy! Sora is here. to the world found Kyrie oh yeah and then we went to look for Riku I 
think that's right so far. Plumrock! What does your journal say, Jiminy? Gee, there's only one sentence. Thank Nominee. Hmm, I wonder who that is. Uh, well, what do you say we find out where we are? All right, party members have been switched. Party in, hell yeah, Donald and Goofy. We now have Sora, Donald, and Goofy, and I feel pretty darn good about that, guys. It is, ah, uh, what a long, long prelude. Uh, that this whole thing actually is so I'm gonna go ahead and give goofy right off the bat the elven bandana that we picked up We don't have any accessories or anything else that we can give them But this is just worth it now Everybody does come with their own items and everything Sora will actually come with whatever Roxas was equipped with hmm I wonder why and abilities Well, we got them so he comes uh, Donald comes with a cure and a thunder right off the bat goofy comes with item boost and Goofy Bash right off the bat, which is great. Sora has everything that Roxas had. No difference whatsoever. Of course, we do have the customized thing and the party. And we have status. We have full menu now. We have our full journal. So this is the actual journal that we need, including uh, character links um, that you can see, you know, how people got associated with who and what that means. We have maps that we picked up here in Twilight Town. We have treasures. Uh, obviously, we don't have any. That's right, none of the ones that you get as Roxas actually count. Oddly enough, a message. Thank Nominee. That's all we have in the album. Story, you can see what's going on. Guided by a voice calling out to him, Sora awoke in a mysterious old mansion. He must have been sleeping there for a long time, but he couldn't remember a thing. Characters, you can see the three that we know so far. That is all. No mini games, nothing. Sora and friends awoke in a mysterious old mansion. They must have been sleeping for a long time. What's more, they had lost all of their memories. Not all of their memories. There is one more thing we can do. So we're looking primarily at Twilight Town. We can actually look at this as well and see character files. We can see other, see all of these things that are going on here. We can see Twilight Town. Um, we can see Heartless. There's nothing there yet. Nobody's. There's nothing there yet. Treasures. Nothing. Maps. Got those character links. This is just in general. Uh, that is all you can do. I know. Weird. And config, of course, just to show you that we are indeed on... Uh, I want to show you something real quick. So we are in critical mode, but I thought I'd show you uh, what the menu of Kingdom Hearts looks like if we just select that. It's just a basic one. Uh, from the first game. You can now view the status of party members from the main menu. All Roxas' abilities and money have been passed on to Sora. Jiminy's journal contains hints of what to do next and past events. So, uh, I'm actually going to put the Kingdom Hearts 2 back on. Um, I just wanted to show you that the command menu. If you don't like this command menu, which is totally reasonable, um, you don't need to use it. Now, we are Sora, which means that we can, we can attack faster. It also means that we can jump, like, his jump, he, he, like, kind of, he's just more spry than Roxas. It's really nice. So, again, we need to go and collect all of the treasures. What's wonderful about this is we can actually see the ones that we've gotten. So, right there, we, will, if we were able to get a Mithril Shard. That is actually super handy because that is useful for none other than synthesizing, which is going to be huge. I'll actually be doing a synthesizing guide as well, just like I did with Kingdom Hearts 1. You can't go back into the mansion just yet. We've got stuff to do. Also, look at our high waters. We've grown while sleeping. I don't know if you guys can tell, but I'm very excited to be back as Sora. It just... <sighs> Sora, man. We can talk to Donald. You were asleep for so long, you still maybe kind of dazed, Sora. Don't worry. If you forget what you have to do, just check Jiminy's journal. Let's talk to Goofy. Don't go back to, s to the mansion. You may fall asleep again. Besides, we should check out what kind of place this is. I'm excited. I'm excited, too. Let's continue into the woods. Ah, uh, that's not the woods. You know... I think I've been to this town. What's the town? Hmm. Guess I must have imagined it. Hainer, Pence, and Olette.
What do you want? Uh, nothing. Just wondering what was back here. Now you know. This is our spot. Lose the two to Andrew Garfield. Um, what? You're new around here, right? I'm Pence. Painter. Nice to meet you. But we got stuff to do, so catch you later. My name's Alette. Hey, did you finish up the summer homework yet? Independent studies are the worst, huh? Homework? Hey, what are your names? Oh, sorry. Uh, we're Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Hey there. Sora, Donald, Goofy, we just met someone who was looking for you. He sure seemed in a hurry. He had a black coat on, so I couldn't see his face. But he had these big round ears. Where'd you see him? At the station. The station, thanks. Well, you'd better get back to that assignment. Later. Kids trying to find us. Yeah, let's get to the station. Alright everybody, I'm going to end the episode here before we continue any further. Thank you so much for watching. It is so great to have our boy Sora back, Donald and Goofy. I'm really enjoying it. I'm so glad that we're back now. Poor Roxas though. That scene is so moving. It's ugh. Ugh. It hurts, man. It hurts. It hurts. We will take, in the next episode, we're going to take a deeper look at Roxas. Uh, this is going to be the uh, gameplay episode. The next episode is going to be a look at Roxas. And then more gameplay after that. But I think it's important to know some of Roxas' backstory before we continue into this game. Now, it does look like Sora woke up without any memories of Chain of Memories or the events that happened in that game. But you can click on a video and you can actually watch that. Showing up on screen right now is a Patreon button for you to support the channel monetarily if you so choose. A dollar a month gets you early access to these videos and there is another video thing that is showing up which is the playlist for what you're watching right now thank you all for watching and remember never give up never surrender to the darkness <laughs>